Hey, what's going on guys? Uh, what's going on? And welcome back to another video. Welcome back to probably, you know what guys, I'm going to go out and say it. If it's not Saquon Barkley, I think the player, the current NFL player that would transition across with their skill set, their overall skill set, and their overall size, speed, stature, and everything else, the best from NFL to rugby would be Russell Wilson. It really would be, come to think of it. And you know, the thing that really, you know, drove that home for me just before was looking at his brand new Madden 21 ratings. Russell Wilson is the only member of the starting lineup of this future team that we're creating right now um, to not have been made yet. And believe it or not, the Madden 21 ratings have just come out. He's come out as an overall 97. Russell Wilson is a 97 overall player. You know, that that's in his respective position, right, as a quarterback. You put him as a wide receiver, he's not going to have an overall rating of 97. But I'm going to grab his statistics. I'm going to do my very best to keep them as accurate as possible. We're going to try and build his face to be as accurate as possible. And then we're going to throw him in the deep end for the All Blacks, just like we've done for the other players. Uh, Russell Wilson will be playing halfback. He'll be playing scrum half. It's a very exciting position for him. Probably the position on a rugby field that is as as similar to being a, a quarterback as possible. And that's why I put Tom Brady in there originally. Um, but the fact is, is that his mobility just isn't there. Although we are going to include him in the substitution bench. Um, so basically I'm making Tom Brady's replacement right now, which is Russell Wilson. Much better overall player. I'm just going to say it. <laughs> doesn't, have as, doesn't have as many Super Bowl rings. But overall, athletically, he's much better, right? And what that means is that in a game of rugby, he's going to be much better. Um, let's get into it. Now, I honestly don't know if Russell will see this um, video. If I did a reaction video to his play, he may. But this is just me having fun, man. So if Russell Wilson does see this video, or if you want him to see it, please tag him in it. But, uh, oh, look at that. You know, the game likes you, Russell, because your name is going to be called. Now, how old are you these days? Um, yeah, um, uh, unless, unless it was like the best troll you could ever find, Oh, he's born two days after me, but two years, two years before, two days after. So one year and 363 days. Um, he's 31. Russell Wilson commented on my uh, top 100 players of 2019 video of him. And uh, he made a, a cheeky remark, actually. He said, you're going to need to get a new jersey there, mate. No, what did he say? Looks like you're going to need a, a new jersey there, mate. And um, I was wearing a, a Leonard Fournette jersey whilst I was doing his reaction. And and, and lo and behold, uh, my man from Dunedin, Harrison, who I'm friends with now, sent me a Russell Wilson jersey. So I do have one. And to be to be fair, I should I should probably put it on, shouldn't I? Yeah, yeah, I'll do that. Here we are. Nick Minute. Boom. Ah. You know what, Russ? I cannot wait to react to your next video wearing this so that you can comment on that and say something else cheeky. I know you'll have something, won't you? Hey, hey, old Russ, hey. All right, 33. Was he 33? Yes, no, 31, what am I talking about? He is left-handed, I believe. Yes, we're gonna go left, left foot. We go USA. We're gonna go with Scrum half. And if he plays rugby sevens, he'll be scrum half as well. Okay, attributes. This is where it gets interesting. We've got we've got some preset stats for a scrum half here. He's pretty fit, right? He's a quarterback, he's gonna run the run the offense. I mean, he takes rushes and then gets back and has enough gas to, to make great passes. I mean he's got a he's got a good tank, he's got a good gas tank. I feel like he trains a lot outside of the game too. Much like Brady. It's just he's a bit more athletically able. Um, I'm going to go 90 fitness. 86 speed, which is interesting, but accurate. 90 acceleration. Aggression? Well, we don't have aggression. We've got strength. You know, I've, I've heard some pretty epic talks by 
Russell Wilson with his players on the field to get them up. So, you know, he can t he can definitely turn it on. I'm going to go 85. Agility, 93. Now that is, that's up there. Break tackle. Well, he can definitely break tackles. We're going to go, that's going to be his strength at number nine. You know, he's going to have the speed and the agility to break tackles and the pass. See, that's where it puts him at that upper echelon. He's got the pass, he's got the speed, he's got the toughness, but the kicking? Now, I'm not saying he can't punt, and I'm not saying he couldn't learn to kick, but at the moment, he's probably at about 50, so we'll, we'll call it 50. But anyway, tackling. Uh, I've seen one of his tackles. He can put his body on the line. We're gonna go 70. Passing, well, what's he got on Madden? Throw power is 91. I believe that's 91. Passing, all right, we'll stick, we'll keep it at 91. Offloading, yep, we'll put that at 91 as well. Now, offloading is basically just a little pop pass, a little lateral, he practices them week after week, we're gonna go 91. General kicking, I'm gonna bring that down to 50. Even though his kicking power is 10, and his kicking accuracy is 19. You know what, I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep it consistent. I'm gonna go bang in the middle. We're gonna go 15, and that is the worst rating for kicking and goal kicking so far but I want to make this one as accurate as possible because I know there's a minute chance that my man Russell Wilson will actually be watching this and if he doesn't watch this then he might be watching when we stage the ultimate match between the All Blacks and Team NFL. Catching we've got 68 and carrying we've got 66. Strength what do we got? This will be interesting actually. 59 okay Decent for a scrum half. Mental agility. Yeah, he's... Yeah. Awareness is 96. Holy shit. Mental agility. Awareness. Sweet. 96. Jumping, we're going to leave it 40. And discipline, I don't want him getting sent off for no reason. We're going to go... We're going to go... We're going to go... No, he's a professional. Uh, I want to put it up. We're going to go 80. There he is. Boom. Let's get the, uh, the complexion right first. Russell Wilson. Oh, there he is. There he is. Um, oh, he's got a bit of... Got some curls going on. Doesn't he? He does have curly hair, so... Is it a crop? I don't know if it's a crop, actually. Um, that's probably it, to be fair. If there's nothing better than that, I'm going... That one. Facial hair. Yep, he's got a bit of... Bit of facial hair. Black. And it's going to be about nature lover. <laughs> what the fuck? All right, that's it. Um, okay. Now we can go and do this. Now, I won't... You're lucky I won't do this to you, Russ. But if you tell a porcupine, this is what's going to happen. Okay. All right, so keep it, keep it honest, mate, and I'll keep your noses as, as normal. <laughs> uh, right, brow. Okay, this is all stuff I haven't really... Holy shit, this could really change the shape of a face, couldn't it? <laughs> oh my god. Oh, wow, what have I done? Um... <laughs> Oh wow, this is crazy. Puffiness, holy shit. <laughs> oh Russ. I reckon we're doing it right here, right? I really do. It's pretty high. Pretty wide. Make him smile, okay. Uh, just normal, I guess. <laughs> Man, you could really make someone look extremely accurate if you really wanted to. Ears, what do we got?
Cheers, big ears. Actually, no, we can do this. We can go down like that and then across like that. That is literally... Bro. That is literally his exact ears. Okay. Now, what else can we do? What else can we do? I feel like that's pretty much all we can do, except for... Hey, fuck, that would... <laughs> Shit, Bigfoot Silver. Oh my god. Bro, this is... This has become way more in-depth and way harder than I thought. We're gonna, we're gonna continue. That's, that's Russ. G'day Russ, how you doing? If I could just confirm your height and weight, then we're pretty much done. 5 foot 11 or 180, we're already there. 215 pounds, 98 kg. Oh. Boom, there we go. Now, I'm gonna say you're pretty fucking lean. Stomach, definition, defined, yep. Arms, we're gonna bring them down slightly. Legs, yeah, you can, you can keep your legs, and that's you. Now, purple boots, and purple long sleeves, and there you have, pretty much 100% sure, would be the most effective player if you plucked him out of NFL and chucked him right on a rugby field right now, no training. And we are about to see if he is really effective, because the position of scrum half is extremely important in rugby. It's the link between the backs and the forwards. Um, you tend to make yeah, critical decisions at all times. Your pass has to be absolutely on point. But you will be kicking it at times. And with that being said, I'm pretty sure we put his kicking at 15, which, yeah, that's, that's going to be interesting to say the least. At the end of the day, guys, it's all for fun. And that's all this is. So Russ, I hope you're having a fantastic day. Everyone else out there, I hope you're having a fantastic day. And we're almost done, guys. We're almost done. We've literally got three more players to do. And they are, in no particular order, Andrew Thomas, Chase Young, and Isaiah Simmons. And if those three players, as rugby players, doesn't get you excited, well, I don't know what will, because they are absolutely dynamite, every single one of them, for different reasons. Wow, wait, what, what a substitution bench Team NFL is going to have, that's all I can say. So guys, we're going we're gonna to save that, we're going to exit, we're going to find him, and have a look at his overall rating. Compared with... What was it? 97 for Madden 21. You know, it's going to be interesting. I, I feel like he's probably, it's probably going to be, it's probably going to be in the high 80s, I'd say. Holy shit. 92. 92. Fantastic. Well, guys, that's that for today. Uh, we're going to put Russell Wilson in at halfback, which means we're going to have to take out Aaron Smith. Um, Aaron Smith is an absolute dynamite player. He's fantastic. He's still playing at the top of his game. He was the All Blacks, you know, starting halfback four years ago when this game was was brought out, and he's only gone from strength to strength. He's literally only got better from there, and that is through hard work, determination, and consistency. And that's what my channel's about. But it's also about having fun. Now, guys, I hope you've enjoyed this video. We're going to throw him in number nine with the All Blacks against the USA Eagles and see how he goes. So everyone out there watching, enjoy, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out. The inaugural World Championship in 1987 was co-hosted and won by New Zealand, who beat France 29-9 in the final at Eden Park in Auckland. New Zealand conceded only 52 points and scored 43 tries in six games en route to the title. The All Blacks have to be the clear favourites going into this. They are clearly in a different class. My comments, man, for this match is Justin Marshall. Beautiful conditions here, Justin. Not wrong, but I expect they'll still come out fighting. Your Blacks form up for the Haka. Oh,
The ground is still shaking. What a hack. And in no time at all, the game will be underway. Short kickoff here. The kickoff snapper. Liam Messam. Forced back in the tackle. Wilson moves it on. Steps back inside and beats the tackler. Relief. Trying to turn it over quickly. Richie McCaw looks for options. Release. Having a go at the ball. Nonu gets the ball away. Up he goes and makes the catch. USA chasing up now. That pass was fine. Very flat. Forward pass. It's been brought back for the scrum. That's a basic mistake. He'll be disappointed with himself for that punch. Find. Set. Davis rolls it in. So far, the defence has been holding out really well. Furious looking scrum down there. That's the ball out there. Good contest and the ball is out. Paul has no answer to that tackle. He's trying to turn it over quickly. He pops the pass nicely. Release. Ball's being contested. Johnson picks the ball up. I want to get some points on the board out of this. That's a lovely pass. On his way to the try line. Dan Carter makes the restart from the 22. Back he goes. No way through there. Chase gathers it out of the back. Turns it back on the inside. He's been taken out of play there. takes it down passes to his support that's a good powerful kick the bounce is good and he reels it in here comes the chase he kicks deep now and a good follow up here from Smith Stewart makes the kick the bounce is favourable yeah he did an outstanding job to secure that catch read it beautifully Daniel Carter races away Julian Sabu with a searching run. Real chance here. And he's over. The try is scored in the corner. Just showed great pace there to score the try. He only needs a little space to work with. Absolutely exceptional try. He's really showing us his skills in this game. Dead right, Justin. It was a beautifully timed run. And the gap, well, it just opened up. Bang on, Justin. Here's the conversion attempt. This one off to the side, but not too difficult. The kick looks good. Edwards restarts. Messam takes in the kickoff. It's still alive on the attacking side. Wilson grabs it out of the back. Now this is a more. McCaw controls it as they try for a few more yards. Gets back to his feet quickly and wrestling for the ball. Wilson picks it out of the back. 
He gets release. Ratke's form, he has to release. He pushes the pass further. He's taken release. down hard. Back to his feet quickly and wrestling for the ball. That's a lovely kick for touch. And they'll take the line out. Banks gets it. Looking to jink his way through. Jinks his way past. Pass inside. Barry brings him to the ground nicely. Having a go at the ball. Davis has the ball. Smith decides to let that one bounce. Such a great catch in his bow. Let's it bounce, but he's gathered it up. Yeah, he took a great catch. He was under all sorts of pressure too, but he handled it well. Back inside. And that's a good burst. The Alamu gets some speed up. Now the kick and chase. Ma'anonu dives after the loose ball. Restart of the 22 gets us back underway. There's some real force in this defence. Flicks a little one. Castle's delivered inside. Brody Rattel puts the pedal to the metal. And penalty. The tackle was a bit high. And they'll look to pull a bit further ahead here. And Carter with the kick. He struck it well and looks pretty useful. Terrific shot from the angle. Good result of some good play. That's a handy lead they've got now. It's a full house and the general mood here is electric. The All Blacks are leading at the break and they're certainly the stronger side so far. Well, plenty to work on in the second half, Justin. Let's take a look at the stats. They've had the ball a lot more in the first half, and the stats back that up. Not many turnovers in the first half. A good number of hit-ups in this game so far, so good work up front. But we've still got plenty of drama and action to come, Nisbo. Kick-off, take it in. Yeah, fantastic catch to secure the ball there. They need to recycle this more quickly. Wyatt Crockett feeds it off now. No way Police. through. They have to release the ball now. Wilson moves it off. That'll knock the wind out of him. He gets it off to the support. Nonu Police. can't be his man. He's got to let it go now. Owen Franks picks the ball up. Julian Savia bursting through with that run. And he's tackled into touch. They are really outstanding in the line-out. It's an area I know they've been working on. Yep, that's right, Justin. Barry goes with the ball. Got a feeling they're going to lose the ball here. Kieran Reid keeps the ball moving. Julian Sabi brought down now. Kieran Reid is absolutely smashed. Wyatt Crockett takes it. Superb technique in that tackle. Franks pushes it on. Strong defense. He's not letting go. He keeps the ball moving. Not a bad run, this. Oh, football! Well played. Good ball retention here. Wilson gathers it out of the back. It'll be a try for sure. Yes, there's the try. They did well. Great teamwork to build that try.
Yeah, he's done very well there. Breaks away, and then no one could catch him. Simply too fast. No doubt about that, Justin. Next up, we'll have the conversion. Not the toughest kick I've seen him line up, but he still takes his time as he looks to add the extra two. And it's wide, so the try remains unconverted. He's just not timing it right at the moment. Edwards kicks off. Conrad Smith to secure this. He's trying to turn it over quickly. A good pass to his support player. Messam is brought to a halt in that tackle. Wilson feeds it off. He gets those legs pumping. Oh! And the penalty is given. He's dead set being hit by a beast. Flattened by the high arm. So they decide to take the points. Carter to kick for goal now. Not able to kick it over and play continues. Stewart puts it into touch. So line out here. On comes the drive, and it's a more. The dummy is there, and look to create something now. Somehow, he's managed to grab that back. Looks for support. Brody Retallick with a good run, and he's finally taken to ground. Your Blacks might still be going here. Wilson pops it up. On his way to the try line, the crowd are out of the seats. That is a try. And he's just looked unstoppable in that try. Pure entertainment. What a great try. As we always say, isn't Conrad Smith having a great game? Dead right. Yeah, he's done very well there. Breaks away, and then no one could catch him. Simply too fast. And there's a shot at goal to come. And he shouldn't have too many problems with this one. And the kickoff is made here. Kickoff nicely taken in. Still there, I think. He spreads it. Lovely tackle. New Zealand chasing hard. Johnson crosses the halfway line. Powerful defence. He's tackled and taken into touch. White block stretching it. Looked like a forward pass. The crowd certainly thought so. And they'll come back for the scrum. He'll be really disappointed with himself there and unforced error. Let's see how the scrum responds here. Find. Oh, they've only got a few Six. minutes to make something. 
Davis rolls it in. USA with a large margin to catch up now. Furious looking scrum down there. We're into the last few ticks of the clock now. Edwards is absolutely smashed. Release. The ref wants him to let go of it. Coleman takes it out of the back. Kevin Mialamu goes Release. down and gets it. The ball's being contested. Shut down with a brutal tackle. He's trying to turn it over quickly. Wilson gets the ball to his support player. Smith hands it back. Sends it flat. Chase stops him. Messam gets it away. And the referee says that is it. New Zealand have won. Your Blacks have claimed the victory. It was a brilliant game. Untroubled in the end and able to come away with a handy win. The handling errors were far too high. They simply lost the ball far too often for a team of this level. No shocks there then. This one played out according to script. The All Blacks dominated almost every aspect of this game. The All Blacks come away victorious. Thanks for joining us. We'll look forward to seeing you next time.